Prime Minister Modi has transferred 17,100 crores to the bank accounts of over 8.5 crore farmers as part of the PM Kisan scheme aimed at providing direct support uh, to farmers. This amount was part of the sixth installment of the PM Kisan scheme that was launched in 2018. The government says it has now provided direct cash benefits of over 75,000 crores to nearly 10 crore farmers as part of the scheme. Well, today the Prime Minister went a step further and launched a financing facility of 1 lakh crores under the Agriculture Infrastructure Fund. This will be utilised to create post-harvest management infrastructure and help farmers with assets like cold storage. Now, Atma Nirbhar Bharat, Atma Nirbhar Bharat Abhiyan ke tahat, किसान और खेती से जुड़े इन सारे सवालों के समाधान ढूंढे जा रहे हैं एक देश एक मंडी के जिस मिशन को लेकर के बीते सात साल से काम चल रहा था वो अब पूरा हो रहा है Himanshu joins us with the latest on that story. Himanshu, how significant uh, were the Prime Minister's announcements today and uh, how are things going to change hereafter? Well, well, Ankita, I think uh, Prime Minister has outlined the, a roadmap for how, on how government actually plans to take the reform process forward. As you know, last month, a series of decisions were taken by the government to reform uh, the agricultural marketing processes. And the fact that Prime Minister today also mentioned that Ek Desh, Ek Mandi is one initiative on which government was working for the last seven years and that's how the process has now fructified. So whether it is giving some minimum income support to farmers in the time of this distress during COVID-19 to initiating larger reform process for creating infrastructure in the agricultural areas. The Prime Minister repeatedly said that just as we set up industries, why can't we set up industries in rural areas specifically to agriculture sector? And that is the primary thrust of the Agricultural Infrastructure Fund, uh, which will be a one lakh fund, 10,000 crore in first year and then 30,000 crore in next three years. That's the government's target. That is the target of investment for creating structures, especially for post-harvesting harvesting processes. If you remember, Prime Minister said that the first Kisan rail is a, a rail, is, is like a coal chain which runs on a rail platform. Uh, it, 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 it will go through several states and the idea is that farmers get the money that they deserve, the income that they deserve for the produce that they produce. And that is largely the thrust uh, which Prime Minister outlined today. And that is why we saw very important interactions also with farmers, producers, organizations. Uh, this is also passed, uh, FPOs as they are called, will be a very important part of implementation of this new roadmap for developing the agriculture sector. So I think very important categorical assertion from the Prime Minister that after initiating or releasing ordinances, government now plans to take the next step on in strengthening the infrastructure, especially in agricultural uh, part of India.